I'm playing GTA 5 for the first time in 10 years. I didn't want to start from the start. I wanted it all from the start. So what I did was download the save file and download the mod menu. I've added a few mods into it. So we're going to have a look at those. But we're just going to go in and just have some fun with it. A lot of people are already going to be onto this. But some people won't be. And we can go to vehicle options and vehicle spawner. Now this has got every vehicle in the game that you can pick. So look, you can even pick trains and stuff like that. So let's do bumper car. Look at that. <laughs> Oh, there you go. We're in a bumper car with no texture whatsoever. Watch out, watch out, watch out. I mean, listen, good start. It is a bumper car. At the end of the day, we're going to bump into things. So I don't know where we're going to go. We're just going to have some fun. My God, this is fast. This is so fast. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. Okay. Okay, good start. That's a nice car. In fact, we're going to ditch the bumper car. I'm going to get this car right here. Now, we also have all weapons. So we can have some fun with this as well. So... I don't know, maybe get the sniper and just... Oh, we missed! Oh, oh, okay, okay, that was terrible. Terrible gameplay. Okay, the sniper wasn't the one. We're going back in the bumper car. Nope. Okay, so you can't go back into it. Okay, so we get to try out another one then. What other funny vehicles do we have? A wheelchair, come on. They see me rolling. Oh my days, oh my days. Let's go, Franklin! Yes! Okay, this is handling a little bit better already. Oh my days. Okay, so the collisions are way in front of the car. Oh my god. Have you ever seen a wheelchair go so fast? Oh my days. Jesus. Oh my god, you're going to need this wheelchair after that, Franklin. Okay, let's get out to that. That's, uh, that was fun. Have we got a toy car? Oh, okay. I like that. I like that. Now, I'm not liking this weather though, so let me just park up on the side of the road here. Let me go down to weather here. We've got extra sunny. There we go. We love that. So what else is there? We've got the police onto us now. They're right there. But we don't want the police. We just go player options. Right there. Once at level zero. See you later, police. Not today. So we've had a little bit of fun with the... Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, so we're down. Wasted. Absolutely thrown through the front of that toy car and just plastered over someone else's car. Okay, so... What you can do with this as well, you can have invincibility. So this playthrough, we're going to do that. Here we go. You won't be going back in there anytime soon, Franklin. Trust me. So player options, invincibility. What else have we got in here? Super run and super jump. Okay, let's toggle them on just for now and just have a look. Oh my. Oh my days. Okay, okay. I don't. That's not really a super run though, is it? All right, we'll turn them off. They're not that good, are they? Let's face it. We can... What's... Smash ability? You hold jump to use the ability. Uh, okay. Oh my god, we're using the force. Actually using the force. The force is strong in this one. And we let go. Oh my days. Okay, okay. Absolute carnage. Okay, we're gonna get. We're gonna have some fun with this one. Oh, here we go. Ready and drop. <laughs> Absolute carnage right now. So what else can we do in this mod menu? Okay, fly manual. This is the one. What's this now? Oh my god, you ready for this? Three, two, one. Yeah! <laughs> and then you can actually fly just like this as well. Why you would ever need to do this? I mean, to get places, I guess. But you can teleport as well. You can just literally set a, a custom marker and then teleport there if you really wanted to. This has been so much fun. Let me tell you that right now. This has been so much fun just to do this. I have got a lot of plans for this. I just need to get used to it, you know what I mean? So got a couple more things to show you and then we will crack on the next thing i want to show you is the object spooner spooner mode you can actually just like add items into it so let me just do something random a spawn entity spawn a pedestrian animal for example an australian shepherd there we go so we got an australian shepherd just in there now we've got some weird ones as well like a humpback whale you can add into the game <laughs> and it just immediately dies i feel terrible and are they killable let's have a look sorry for all you vegans out there and all you vegetarians yeah they are very killable that's already dead so there's nothing we can do about that um oh, i feel terrible there. Look at the all over the floor i'm sorry i'm sorry anyway this object spooner i've got a couple of things so if i go to manage save files here I've got this thing here, which doesn't really work that well, but we can teleport to reference so we can see where it is. And then we can load the placements. Now, this is going to load everything that the creator has put in there. So it's going to have a big ramp, but it doesn't load the buses. It's meant to have 50 buses in between. it. If I wanted to, I could spawn the buses in there, but we're not going to do that. What we can do now is just spawn in some vehicles. Go-kart, maybe. Uh-oh, that's because I've got... Okay, I understand. Yeah, we don't want fly mode on. There we go. I'm going to have a little bit more fun with this because you can actually change the speed of the go-kart. But I just want to see if we can actually make it just with this now. Hopefully it's light enough. Not a chance. Surely not a chance. 
No, just short. Now, we could have made that probably if we give it a little bit more of a run up. Or we can just go vehicle options. Then we can go in vehicle multipliers, acceleration, nine. Let's see what that does. Ready? So that is now max speed pretty much instantly, you know? And look at the speed we're going. So now. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. Hey, hey, that was pretty sick. Pretty sick, that Franklin. I'll give you that. Okay, here we go. Here we go. And there's the jump. Have we got enough height this time? I think we have. Oh my days, we nearly it's went to space, to man. Jesus Christ, we nearly ended on the moon. So that's that one. So you can have a bit of fun with that. You can spawn some stuff into it and jump over it if you really wanted to. I've got a load of plans for this game now because this has just opened up an absolute Pandora's box, if you want to call it, of content for me. So GTA is where I'm going for the next foreseeable future, or so it seems. But yeah, I'm having so much fun with it so far. Let me tell you that right now. So if you want to see it, don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and turn that notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. Oh, I just remembered. I've got one more thing that I've added into this game. And oh my God, I completely forgot that I added this in. Right? Okay, so what is it? Uh, S.A. Dead? Yes, this is it. Welcome to Zombies in GTA. That's all I can say. Ready? Watch this. Now we're going to get attacked by pedestrians, but they're going to be like starving zombies, like Resident Evil style or Call of Duty zombie style. So we need to just go somewhere where there's pedestrians. See, look, 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 look. See? See? And we can't kill them. Oh, no, he's, he's glitched. I've glitched out. I can't actually kill them. I've glitched out for some reason. Okay, okay, okay. What can we do now? Player options. Oh, no, this has failed as well. Okay, settings. Oh, please, please, please work. I'm just getting beaten down. Things have stopped working. Yeah, that is that. That is a good place to end it because I am just getting battered now. But what we can do as well is just go SA dead again. And then that will kill them all. But as you can see, he's looking like he's got Parkinson's or something like that now. And just shaking like mad. So I think that's a good place to end it. Uh, keep an eye out for the next one when I try and figure out how to actually work these things. But I'm having a lot of fun doing this anyway. So yeah, catch you in the next one. Peace.